What's going on YouTube? This is Kevin here from TGI Tech Day here bringing you guys a quick look at Line's new feature of Mission Control. Mission Control is Apple's way of kind of combining spaces and expose into one nice, I guess, control center as this seems to appear. And when you first install Lion, you will have this icon in the lower left hand corner of your screen near on the dock. It's called Mission Control and it has this kind of you can kind of see just by the icon what it's about. It kind of does have that expose like look, but it also can manage your spaces pretty well as well. So this is what Mission Control looks like. You're actually looking at it right now in its active state. Uh, just to let you guys know, if you want to activate Mission Control, you can obviously click on the icon in the dock, or you can do a multi-touch gesture. That gesture is taking four fingers and swiping up. So you put your four fingers at the bottom of the trackpad and then swipe up and then you will be able to activate Mission Control. If you want to swap between spaces, say you want to scroll, you can either activate Mission Control and then swipe left and right with four fingers, or you can just be in an active space and then do the same thing. It still works. Now, of course, if you have, say, four desktops and you're on this very last one and you want to get to the first one, it's not always efficient to scroll through those pages to get to your email, let's say. So the easiest way is obviously swiping up and then clicking on any of the given desktops at the top. So you want to go to your mail, you can go ahead and go to your mail quickly and just as easily you can go to that blank desktop that you were working on. So that's pretty much spaces. You can create new spaces very easily, very new desktops. You just run your mouse to the top right corner of the screen and click on that plus sign and you can add infinitesimally many desktops as you so need for your work or play or whatever you're doing with your computer. So let's just go to the expose part now. If you go to say Safari, this might be an application where you have multiple windows open. So let's open say three more windows. And let's say you are, I don't know, you're on YouTube on this one and maybe you're on Twitter on this one, and maybe you are, I don't know, let's close this one just for now. But you have all these windows open, and if you're on a small computer, this might get a little bit messy. But what you want to do is you can still swipe up with four fingers, and then Mission Control will automatically group any windows that are from the same application. So you have all these Safari windows here, and you can click on any given one. You see how there's a blue halo around the one that you're currently over? You can click on this one, say I want to activate this middle one, you just click on it and then that will immediately come to the foreground. Now if, say, you don't remember what's in this, say this isn't labeled Mac OS X line features launchpad, and say you just want to look at it, you can click on it and then drag it to the front a little bit and it'll show up. And you can just let it go and then it'll go back to the way it was and then you can say go to your Twitter window. But that is how you would deal with expose, that's actually... Um, quite the easy way. But also if you say were to do that again, not tab, new window, and say go to YouTube, you can also do a four finger swipe gesture pulling down. And that will do expose for just that application. So if you have multiple Safari windows open, great. You can view each of the Safari windows in a nice organized manner. This is a lot easier in my opinion than doing the four swinger four finger swipe gesture up and then clicking and dragging. This four finger swipe is if you have multiple applications open in one uh, desktop. So say you have system preferences and say you have a pages document open. You can open up each of these and then as you can see it's pretty busy in this space. Four fingers up and you can see your pages document is here, your safari is all here and you can still select each and every one of those windows if you so wish to do so. System preferences right here. Now say you want to clean up some of this space. You can move your pages document or your Safari windows or any uh, application you want, clicking and dragging on the icon and then dragging that up to a new desktop. Of course, you can always drag these up to a new space or a new desktop just like that, very easy. And if you close out of, say, desktop five, system preferences will automatically come to the space that you're currently looking at. So that is how you would deal with spaces and that is a quick look at also how expose works on um, well at least the expose like replacement on 
uh, Mac OS 10.7 Lion. Also, I'm giving a quick plug to my video that I just released on Launchpad. It will be a similar video like this, uh, dealing with the features of Launchpad and uh, its great wonders. So that is pretty much the quick wrap up of Mission Control and how it works in Mac OS X line. I want to thank you guys for watching and feel free to rate, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys next tech day.